<laughs> what? Hey guys, it's a beautiful April day and we're gonna go to Costco before we go to the Mariners game. Super nice weather here in Seattle. And we're always excited to go to see a baseball game and also go to Costco, right guys? Yeah! Yeah! Go check out some skincare there as well as pick up some groceries. And I'll be pointing out things that I recommend and maybe I don't recommend. So let's do this. We're going to Costco. And we're going to Costco. We love Costco. Yeah? So as soon as you walk in, you see one of my favorite over-the-counter retinols, Olay Regenerous Retinol 24, and on sale. $35 for two, you can't beat that price anywhere else. Here we have the Vitamin C Plus Peptide 24 Serum. I've not tried the serum, but I've tried the moisturizer, and the moisturizer is great. It has peptides, the Vitamin C derivative, niacinamide, and it does have fragrance, so unfortunately, if you don't like fragrance, then you might not want to use that one. Costco really highlighting its skincare presence by putting them all up front as soon as you walk in. I feel like Costco could up their sunscreen game, get more of a variety. They have have a lot of sprays they have a lot of chemical based sunscreens i have no problems with chemical based sunscreens but some of my patients are very sensitive to things like able benzone neutrogena is just fine but it has a lot of chemical uv filters in the helioplex line and some people do get a photo allergy to the chemical uv filters but then again i dr spf i don't want to demonize chemical uv filters costco just needs more of a variety a big kudos to Costco for having sun shirts with UPF fabric, which is ultraviolet protection factor. Typically see it ranging from 30 to 50. UPF 30 blocks 96 to 97% of UV radiation, whereas UPF 50 plus is the highest grade and that blocks up to 98%. Some nice shirts we got here, right on. Okay, so I'm gonna buy this three pack. I'm gonna use this for running. I'm a medium size and this is UPF 30. Great, we're gonna grab this. And only 10 bucks for two shirts, nice. Don't rely on natural sunlight exposure to increase your vitamin D levels. I use vitamin D3 to supplement my well-balanced diet. Even surfers in Hawaii have vitamin D deficiency, so don't rely on the sun for vitamin D. A lot of people are taking biotin. I feel like it can help with brittle nails, but for hair loss, there's no strong evidence for this. Also in high doses, over 10,000 micrograms per day, it can really mess with your labs, your thyroid labs, and even troponin enzymes for your heart. Oh, to buy Neosporin in the bulk is a huge sin. Don't do it. Now going on to minoxidil, this is great. You can't beat this deal. You have three months worth of minoxidil, 5%. You wanna look for the 5% on the box. It's a foam where I feel like my patients do tolerate foams better than the drops. And for women, disregard the four men labeling. You can still use this. I don't know why I'm like waddling to the skincare aisle. I think I'm embarrassed that I'm trying to film, but I always tell my patients now, just choose any moisturizer at Costco because they're all really good. Going to shampoos, I like zinc pyrithione in my shampoos for my dandruff. I do use head and shoulders every other day and alternate with ketoconazole shampoo. Then turning 180 degrees, you have great skincare behind me of Aveeno. This body lotion is nice. It has oatmeal, which is soothing for my eczema patients. Cetaphil's gentle skin cleanser is solid. Great deal. It has a little mini travel size bottle to go with it. It has panthenol, vitamin B3, and glycerin. And you got the body moisturizer, which is nice. I've done a comparison video this versus equate and this did win now we have cerave hydrating facial cleanser which is awesome especially for those with dry skin lubriderm great for body moisturization crazy ten dollars for 54 ounces of this fragrance free lotion and i'm locked in as king when it comes to dry hands and feet with cracked fissures and again more sprays here with the chemical uv filters we need to have more variety costco okay now walking by we have some nice eye products by rock that i have to review later on then, ooh, Neutrogena Regenerating Cream here. This is a retinol. I'm totally buying this. This is actually on sale 25 for two. That is bananas. I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna do an Instagram giveaway soon. And this is perfect. I want to do a two winner giveaway. I don't ever routinely recommend collagen supplements to my patients. I don't see danger, but does it have strong evidence? No. When looking at the studies that aren't backed by the company, I feel like it does help with hydration. It does help with hyaluronic acid stores. So that's interesting. By improving hydration, you do plump up your skin and thus could help with fine lines and wrinkles. And then you can say, yes, yeah, anti-aging. So they do have the moisturizer I was talking about by Olay. I use vitamin C in the morning before my sunscreen to brighten the skin. Okay, so we're gonna check out. I got the two packs of Olay, Neutrogena, and the CeraVe Moisturizing Cream, which is nice because it has a pump. All right, we're leaving now. Try not to get hit by a car. This is the nicest guy ever. He was fist bumping me and the kids earlier. So nice every time we visit Costco. Thanks for shopping with me. Hey guys, so I'm back from Costco. I got great picks. What a deal here. 
this was on sale and this wasn't on sale but very much so available and I have not seen Costco do this twofer of the Neutrogena Rapid Wrinkle Repair Regenerating Cream. So this is a retinol and I did a compare video between the two. So really need to see both available at Costco. The, just letting you know this is, is not the fragrance free uh, version. It's paraben free, mineral oil free, dye free. But this one is the scented version. So just letting you know because they have two different ones and it will say fragrance free on the bottle. So I just wanna show you guys how they look and feel. Also able to get the CeraVe Moisturizing Cream two pack here, great for the body. You can use this on the face, not comedogenic. It has three essential ceramides, which you see with CeraVe products. A great uh, moisturizer to put on after your shower while your skin is damp. That's probably the best tip we can give you for dry skin care is applying moisturizer after the shower. Studies are now showing that frequency of showering and also duration isn't as important as putting on moisturizer afterwards. They still have to investigate to see is does temperature really make a difference, but in general we say don't use scalding hot water in the shower. I know it does feel good, but it, you will pay for it later because it does wash away your natural oils and technically dry you out. So just keep that in mind that you know if you have sensitive skin, fragrance free, um, you wanna go with gentle products that do have the stamp of approval from the National Eczema Association. I don't see it on this box. Oh, there you go. There's that seal, the NEA seal. Wow. So this is a uh, big thumbs up where you get this seal for just pretty much having ingredients that aren't getting you in trouble typically. So um, definitely check this one out and great to have a twofer. And this one is with a pump which is really cool. I'm usually I'm usually used to the jar, but now having the pump is great for my male patients who like the one-handed pump. Using a jar with the lid is kind of cumbersome at times. Okay, let's first tackle cleansers. I saw some cleansers at Costco. The Gentle Skin Cleanser by Cetaphil. Different look, a new look. I've been recommending Cetaphil's Gentle Cleanser for a long time. This is a gentle cleanser. It has great ingredients like niacinamide, which we all love, vitamin B3. It has vitamin B5 or pro-vitamin B5, panthenol, that's a great ingredient to help hydrate, but also be an emollient in the skin. So you see that in moisturizers. And it also has glycerin, which is that classic humectant that draws in water. Cetaphil does put who this is intended for. The gentle, gentle skin cleanser, dry to normal sensitive skin, okay? Whereas the other one, which I didn't see at Costco, I don't believe I saw it, uh, the daily facial cleanser looks very similar. But if you look at the label here, you're gonna see the glycerin, vi uh, vitamins B5 and B3, the niacinamide, but you'll also see that it has, who it's intended for here, combination to oily sensitive skin. So that's something more you might consider in the summer. If you have combo skin, you might wanna deal more with the daily facial, whereas this is more hydrating, good for fall, winter, early spring weather. For those of you who are anti-fragrance, just know that this has mask and fragrance. Mm -hmm. Daily Facial Cleanser has the masking fragrance, whereas the Gentle Skin Cleanser, think gentle, this has no masking fragrance at all. This is a great one. I've used more of this one. I can just tell this is uh, almost out. This is my own stash here. So I think this is great. I think Costco has it too for 20 bucks. Great deal. Lasts a long time, a little goes a long way. Uh, moving on here, we have the moisturizers. After you cleanse, after a shower, use your moisturizer. I just wanna show you CeraVe's nice cream texture here, it's amazing. Just melts away so quickly as soon as you rub it into your body, your hands. If you were to put it on your hands, it doesn't leave a sticky residue either. So just the gold standard for uh, moisturizing cream. I have to still do a comparison between the moisturizing cream and Cetaphil's uh, cream uh, in the jar. So um, really cool that the Costco form has the pump. What the heck is on my lid here? It looks like I left a coffee on it. Um, but anyways, this uh, check this one out at Costco, the two pack, and just again, the shot of the moisturizing cream. Just really nice texture there. Now going on to the retinols. I did see a few months back, or was it several months back, the capsules, uh, retinal capsules were on sale and available at Costco. I didn't see it this time around, so just keep an eye on it. Maybe they'll rotate through the retinols. But right now we have the insane deal of the Retinol 24 by Olay Regenerous on sale, the two pack. You can't beat that deal anywhere. Amazon, on any other online retailer would not have a good a deal as Costco's Olay. Now just 
Someone did, um, a viewer did mention this in the other video that the link I have to the product might take you just to the Olay Regenerous Retinol 24. The plus peptide is just a different name, but the formulation is still the same. The links that I provide, I don't think Amazon and some of these other places are up to date, like Target did change their website image. But um, just letting you guys know, the formulation is the same. The old Retinol 24 labeling still had the palmitoyl pentapeptide 4 complex, still had peptides in it, which helps boost collagen through cell signaling. So just getting you a heads up that the labeling is different, but it always had peptides. They're just drawing attention to peptides because it works really well with retinol. And so just a small amount of this is all you need. And um, I'm just gonna put a little bit on my face. I'm gonna make it a half pea size amount and then just dots on your face. You would apply it to your whole face, but I'm gonna use the other side for uh, the Neutrogena. And then just connect the dots at bedtime. This one is moisturizing, so it's it has the moisturizer as well in it. So it's already two steps in one right there. You have the retinol, you have the peptides, you have the hydrating um, glycerin in this. You have niacinamide, which helps brighten the skin and help regulate sebum production. You could put extra retinol onto your neck, but be careful because that is sensitive skin. So you might want to maybe use a, even a smaller amount on the neck, just the thinnest film to start off with. Now next is Neutrogena's Rapid Wrinkle Repair Regenerating Cream. This one is the scented version, like the one at Costco. I'm gonna put a small amount on this side of the face. And I did do a comparison video, like I mentioned before. Both great moisturizing retinols for beginners. They don't disclose the retinol percentage in either one, but both are great. Makes your skin feel really nice and silky smooth afterwards. Great to do at bedtime before you, you go to sleep. If you pair this retinol, the retinol oil with the cream, the regenerating cream, you get that extra nice softening of your face before bedtime. So I really like that trick there. And that one, um, that retinol, oil does disclose it has 0.3 percent retinol pure retinol on that one this one has the retinol sa it's not salicylic acid but it's sustained action so it has like this glucose complex mixed in and so it helps with sustained action it has hyaluronic acid in uh in this one whereas the uh olay does not have um hyaluronic acid just has glycerin uh, but this one doesn't have the niacinamide so great trade-offs between the two um i like that costco is carrying that but if you don't like fragrance you know you might want to stick more with the Olay Regenerous because at Costco they only have the fragrance version but the Olay Regenerous only one version and it's always dye free and fragrance free okay so, yeah I really like my sun shirt that I picked up for or my my pack of sun shirts that I got at Costco the UPF clothing that material is really key in the in the sun because you don't have to like wait for it to set in like a sunscreen has to you have to wait 15 20 minutes for it to set into your epidermis to protect you UPF clothing is like ready to go. As soon as you step out, it's gonna start protecting you. So um, hope this video is helpful. Thanks for coming with me to Costco. We love Costco. Uh, you might spend $1,000 at Costco and you always need that $1.50 hot dog and drink at the end just to make you feel a little bit better. Um, you guys all can relate to that, I'm sure. So I wanna say again, hope you guys had a happy Mother's Day and definitely check out my Instagram giveaway. I'm gonna be giving away the retinol capsules, the Olay Regenerous for the Retinol 24 and the Neutrogena Regenerating Rapid Wrinkle Repair and the CeraVe Moisturizing Cream. I'm gonna give it to two winners, so check out my Instagram to enter. So please hit the like button, please subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys for the next video. Take care, peace.